of the new year, many people are looking to get healthy. And maybe you're thinking of trying one of the latest diets, but do they actually work? Well, Aisha Scott tried the detoxing method to find out. Look what I picked up today. It's my juices for my detox and my alkaline water in the uh, back there. So here's how it works. Basically, you take six juices per day. It's a three-day detox that uh, Juice Bar 8020 offers. And there are two different detoxes you can choose from. Uh, this one that I'm doing is the more advanced uh, detox. So we'll see how that goes. I'm really excited, but I'm kind of nervous about it too. Hey guys, I just finished the first day of my detox and I gotta admit, it was not easy because I'm used to eating about every three, about every four to five hours or so um, and not having any food was, was rough for me. But surprisingly, the juices were really good. By the third day, I was dreaming of food but was surprised at how much energy I did have consuming only liquids. Now, I sat down with registered dietitian Shay Arluck, and she broke down the pros and cons of juice detoxing. All right, so let's talk about the pros and cons of juicing, because of course, with the good comes the bad. So a couple of pros for you of juice detoxing. There are lots of vitamins and nutrients, and it can decrease the addiction. So if you drink a lot of alcohol or maybe caffeine, it could certainly help with that. But some of the cons, low calories, so you're not getting the tip typical calorie uh, count that you would normally. And then a dangerous blood sugar level swings due to uh, the high sugar in some of the fruit as well. All right, well, Shay says juice detoxing may not be for everyone. You'll want to check with your physician before starting any diet, so keep that in mind. If you are interested, though, in trying a one or three day detox, you can head over to Juice Bar 8020 in Virginia Beach. All right, Aisha, thank you. I'll keep it right